Ford's modular engine is the current and future of Mustang performance. Unfortunately, if you've got a modified 96 through 98 Mustang, 99 through 04, or a new S197, you know how fragile the stock engine can be. Today on Power TV, we're going to talk to the modular engine experts at Livernoy Motorsports. They are one of the premier builders of two, three, and four valve short blocks, long blocks, and complete engines. And we'll talk to NMRA racer Roxanne Shepard, who uses a Livernoy engine in her nine second Mustang, built and machined in house at Livernoy using their state of the art equipment. You may not be building a mega horsepower modular engine like this one on a dyno, but even for a complete modular street engine, there is a lot to be said about doing your research when picking an engine builder. One of the real weaknesses in the modular engine is in the short block, especially the pistons and rods. Livernoy uses an exclusive Molly forged piston, which is a major upgrade over the stock piston design, especially in boosted or power adder applications. It's forged from M124S aluminum alloy, and it's available for low compression, naturally aspirated, and high compression applications, and features two coatings, a phosphate complete piston coating, as well as the super slippery grapple skirt coating, which reduces friction. Other upgrades on the Livernoy short blocks include a forged steel crankshaft, manly H-beam rods, and of course, a new iron or aluminum block. Once finished, these short blocks are capable of handling just about all the power you can pour into them. We are here at Livernoy Motorsports Engine Build Room showcasing our modular engine using a three-valve engine. I am proud to say that all our components are made here in the United States. Some of the products we use are top names such as Manly Connecting Rods and Molly Motorsport Pistons. These items are not off the shelf. They are produced and sold only to Livernoy's using our specifications. Our engine build rooms are climate controlled. Our processes are double and triple checked to ensure our customers get the best quality in the industry. When it comes to machine work and assembly, a well-built modular engine requires extremely tight tolerances and specifications. To meet those, Livernoy has some of the top flight hardware, like a Sun and Digital Balancer, Rottler and Sun and Bore and Hone machines, computerized Rottler CNC machining center, and even something called the Suff Test Profilometer, which measures surfaces for optimal finish. We followed along during a customer's three-valve buildup at Livernoy, where we watched the careful assembly process which takes almost two days. It starts with installing the Clevite main bearings, ARP studs, and then the forged steel crankshaft, which is capable of well over 1,000 horsepower. After installing the main caps carefully over the crankshaft, we're ready for step two. We have done final inspection for assembly. We've installed the main bearings, installed the crankshaft, measured crankshaft end play, assembled the rods and pistons, and file fit the ring. Next, we will start installing the pistons and torquing the rods. We're almost halfway through this 30-point inspection process with this engine build. The same standard of quality is built into every engine we build. We don't sell extras, we don't have stages, we sell one race-proven package that is unmatched in the industry. While the guys at Livernoy are installing the pistons and rods into the three-valve, we talked with modular racer Roxanne Shepard, who uses a Livernoy two-valve engine along with custom Livernoy cams. I have been running a Livernoy Motorsports engine for seven years. I run their modular motor two valve long block with their camshafts and their heads. Um, with the Vortec Supercharger, this car has run a best time of 960 at 145. They're very durable motors. Um, I run the same, I run all year on the same motor. We just have it freshened up between seasons. Looks like the engine builders are about finished up with day two of the buildup. Let's check back in with Livernoy on the progress. Here we are, day three of our Livernoy's modular engine buildup. We've installed the piston and rod assemblies and finished our final inspection process. This means the engine has been triple checked by our senior engine builder to ensure proper quality control has been achieved. This engine has passed all of our tests and now can be shipped to the customer for final install in the vehicle of choice. Livernoy offers two, three, and four valve modular short blocks for around $4,000, depending on specific options and whether you want an aluminum or iron block. And at the end of the day, you can rest assured that you've got a solid foundation under the hood of your 96 and later Ford Mustang. Check out Livernoy on the internet at www.livernoymotorsports.com.